Hey Jay Rockers, good afternoon. Well, I'm out here with Summer, and the goal today is we're gonna catch some mine cichlids. I came out here the other, about a month or so, I was out here herping, and I came across some mine cichlids, and I caught a few that day, made a video, and we're gonna come back out here and see if we can't do it again. And Summer likes to catch mines just as much as I do, so both of us are gonna be using some dead shrimp, a little teeny one, uh, number four hook, and see if we can't catch some mines, y'all. See what we can do. So we're going to walk down here real slowly, see if we can't see some Mayans before we walk over here and try to cut some. I see a few right there. There's a few Mayans right there. Sitting right there, you can see the little stripes. There's a big Mayan right there in the bed. Actually, there's a whole bunch of mines right there y'all look at this can you see those summer yeah there's some big mines right there a whole bunch of them all right let's go get our rods see if we can't catch a couple of these guys i'm just going to show you what we're going to do we brought some dead shrimp with us we're just going to peel the dead shrimp and we're just going to get little pieces and we're going to put it on this number four hook, just a little number four hook. And we're going to be freelining it, no weight. Just throw it out there and hopefully we can catch some. If we can catch about, I don't know, we can catch about 10 or, 10 or a dozen, I'll consider this a good trip and I'll be really happy. But both Summer and I are both just ecstatic that we can basically come in our own backyard and catch Mayans now instead of having to drive all the way down to South Florida. It's pretty awesome, ain't it? That's pretty awesome. All right, guys, we're just watching where we're stepping because last time I came over here, I basically stepped right on a black racer. But golly, look at all these Mayans. There went a frog. Put a couple shrimp right there. All right, Summer, you go first. Just pitch it right out there. Pitch it right past. See where those are out there? Pitch it right past it, just as light as you can. There you go. Let it sit. Let's sit. He'll come get it right there. One will come get it. Now reel it back in. Oh, you got one? Oh, you got one. All right. She's got one. Oh, it came off. All right. My turn. We'll come down a little bit further somewhere. All right. Right there, see what we can do. Oh, I got one right there. There we go, right there. Just that quick. That one's all right, we can keep that one. There, since these are an invasive species, there is no size limit and no bag limit. And you can get some really nice fillets off fish that small. But look at that beautiful fish. That is awesome. Yeah, all kinds of guys. Get down there, see if you can't get one. Just cast right back out there. See where those are right there? Oh, you got one. You're gonna get, oh, you, you moved it. <laughs> Here, walk down there further if you need to. Just keep an eye out for alligators because I know they're here. There you go. Reel it in just a little. All right, leave it right there. They'll come get it. They'll come get it. He's, he almost had it. Get him. Oh. <laughs> Try it again. Come on, Summer. Get one. All right. Click the bail and just let it sit there. Get him. Get him. Get him. You got him. That's a good one, Summer. Oh, heck yeah. That's a fat one. Okay, go ahead and put him in the bucket. We'll get me another shrimp. That's a good one, Summer. That's how easy it is, guys. 
And I know probably some of you are saying, oh, but these are small fish. They're tasty and they're invasive, so it's good to get them out of the environment. And they're just a cool fish. It's not a fish you get to really catch that often because they're not native. But how cool is that? High five, Summer. All right, get you another one. Get in there. Get one. Oh, don't let it stop right there. Reel it up, reel it up. Don't let it stop. Unless he got it, he might have got it. Hey, he got one. That's a good one, Summer. That's a good one, kid. All right, put him in the bucket. That's the biggest one so far. Watch out. Let me see that one. That's a good one, man. Oh, my foot went in the goop. That is a good one. Good job, kiddo. That's three fish, y'all, in like not even five minutes. All right, y'all. Let's see if we can get some of these bigger ones that are right here. Okay, I'm already engaged. That's a good one right there. Oh, he spit it out. Did you see the size of that one right there? And he spit it out. There we go, got him. That's a good one right there. That's awesome. Look at the size of that one. That's a good one. Yeah, that is a nice one. All right, that's a really good size mine. Go get you one. All right. And they do got little teeth, y'all. That's a nice mine. Hey, he's way bigger than those other ones. Flick it out of there. Okay, let's sit, let's sit. Drop it. He's got it, he's got it, he's got it. Get him, get him, get him. There he is, all right. Another good one. This is super fast fishing. Summer likes stepping in, she likes stepping in that hole. All right, well that's, that's one, two, three, four, five. All right, let's go put these in the cooler and we'll get some more shrimp. About five minutes worth of fishing right there, y'all. See if we can both get down here. Just watch out for that hole. So we can both do it at the same time, see what we can get. All right. She's right there. I'm out there. No, I don't know. You prick yours up. Oh, you got one. That's a good one. <laughs> Summer already got one. I got ants on my foot. Good one, Summer. So that's number six. Here's some ants down here because I got ants all over my feet. All right. Let's see if we can get another one. Oh, wow. He took it so hard. Jeez. Yeah. Cast it back out. I can't believe one ain't eat you yet. Probably has. I'll leave it right there. I got a big mine sitting right over there. Did you get one yet? Oh. Reel up, reel up. You got him. Oh, golly. A nice one, too, Summer. Look how pretty these things are, man. God. That is just the coolest fish, I think. I really do. All right. She got that one. I want to see if I can't get one of these big ones that are over here. Let's see what happens right there. I think I got one. Nope. There's one sitting right here, bedding up. That's a nice one right there. Oh yeah, that's a really nice one. Oh yeah. That's a really good one right there. My nickname for these things is the Atomic Sunfish. They fight better than a bluegill. And they're just super cool looking. Look at the patterns in them. 
That is just so awesome. Actually, some of them have one. Yep, she's got another one. That's a good, look at the colors on that one. She, she's waxing them over here. That one's got some cool colors. Some greens, like turquoise in them. Super cool. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. All right, let's see if we can do that again. All the way over there. Come on, mines. I think I just, I think one just picked it up. Yep. Oh yeah. Oh, look at the size of this one. Wow, that is a nice size Mayan. Holy cow, Summer. Look at this one, babe. Did not tie the hook very well. Oh, I, I just, they're, they get hard mouths. They probably just wore it out. Look at the size of that one. That's a good, look at that. That's a really good Mayan. All right, I gotta put another hook on for summer. Just throw that in there. That's a good one, man. Golly. Fatty. Oh, really? You leave it right there. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, you got him. That's a big one, Summer. Get him, get him, get him. I got this in You got him. That's a good one. Look at that one. That's your biggest one. Do you swallow it? It's just kind of. It's just in Can you get it? Of All right. Well, while she's messing with that one, we got mines over there boiling. While she's messing with that one, I'm gonna try go back over here where I'm hooking those really big ones. We've already caught 11 fish and we haven't even been here 20 minutes. It's like fishing in a barrel, basically. Yeah, I think I got one right there. Yep, there's one. That's another good one, too. Oh, God, I get out of there. These things fight so good, guys. So good. That's 12 fish in <coughs> less than 20 minutes. Some of these are really, really good. Get more shrimp. And don't really get much easier than this. Fishing wise. Here, come on down, Summer. I'm gonna go back over there. Probably watch one come right up and get that one. Nope. You got it? Yep. <laughs> that quick. That is just crazy. That's just craziness. Drop it right there somewhere. See if one comes for it. Reel it up a little bit. You bring it in. There's one big one right here. See if you'll see it. You drop it right there. He's going to it. He's going to it. He's got it. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Oh, you got him? You got him? Yep. All right, here we go. There's another one. Another good one. Another good one. Sweet kid. All right, let's go see if we can find a little more concentration of them. Not that many of them right here. Guys, we're in a new spot, and I see a Mayan right here. Let's see if he'll be. Oh, here comes one out here. I just put my rod in the water. I can just 
I got one. You got one too? Summer got one and I got one. <laughs> Yours is pretty good. Oh, this one. There you go. Mine went back in the water. That's a good one. So just go ahead and throw yours right in the cooler. All right. Well, Summer got one. I think I just got one. Yep, I got one. Little guy. Itty bitty one. How cool they look. Almost look like a mango snapper. Oh, you get him, Summer? Oh, there you go. Good one, kid. She's in there fishing in a tree, catching fish. It's crazy. Yeah, throw him straight on the cooler if you can. I'm catching the dinkies, and she's catching fish to put in the cooler. Hey guys, we're driving around right now looking to see if we can find more, and I came right here, and there is a... There was a big mine sitting here. Now I don't see him. There he is. Oh, yeah. There's a couple good mines right here couple really good ones Let's see if one of these will eat this there's that big one right there there you go there's one little one there's that big one right there ah, he won't come back and get it see any over there be careful for alligator summer. All right. Oh, that one got that. Yeah, he got it. He's not eating though. There we go. There we go. There's a good one. That one will work. You see any Mayans? No, there's some over here, honey. All right. We got another one. Sweet. Oh, there's some big ones. See that big one right there? Let's see how get it. Did he get it? I don't know. Yeah, you got it. You got it. Good, good. Mine somewhere. Oh, get him out of there. Get him out of there. Get him out of there. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> that was awesome. High five, man. He, he ate that quick. Yeah, that real quick. Awesome. Got a little bit of shrimp on there. You might be able to get another one. Awesome. Don't get in those rocks. He's coming, he's coming. Oh, he was coming. Oh, here he <laughs> oh, sweet. Oh, look at the colors on that one. Man, those are some pretty fish. Well, look at that, y'all. We got a pile of Mayans in there. Probably got close to, I don't know, 20 maybe? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, I got 18. We got 18 Mayans. Not too bad for just an hour of fishing. Got some really good, that's a really good one right there. Not bad. All right, y'all. Well, that's gonna be our video. We came out for what, an hour? We've only been out here an hour, y'all, and we got about 18 Mayans in the cooler and we caught a whole bunch more. It's just absolutely fun fishery out here. Now that I know that it's here, we can come down here anytime we want. If we're bored, which is like we were today, we didn't plan on going offshore, didn't do any major fishing trips. Just sitting at home, it's like, you know what? Let's go take a drive and see if we can't go catch some Mayans. And we did just that. Super minimal equipment, just a real light setup, ultra light setup, number four hook, free line with a piece of dead shrimp. You have a ball, huh? Have a good time. Well, thank you guys very much for hanging out with us and watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you like these Mayan videos, put me a comment down in the comment section. We'll keep coming out and doing some more. Whether we make a video or not, we're still going to come down here and catch them because we just love doing it. So let us know if you guys like watching it. And until we see you all again, tight lines, Jetty Rockers. Please don't hit, forget to hit that subscribe button, that little bell for notifications so you get notified every time I do a new upload. And that like button, y'all. That like button really helps us out, guys. Until we see you all again, tight lines. Check you all later.